All right, guys, welcome back to another gameplay guide. Today, I'm going to teach you guys the Riven versus Aurelia matchup in a rain game, guys. Rain Diamond Elo on my Smurf accounts, playing in Smurf queue. My hands are stained. Now, for this matchup, I definitely recommend you guys to go Conqueror as always, uh, but then taking Shield Bash with Bone Plates. And what that's going to do is it's going to make the matchup different it's actually going to make our matchup like a lot stronger i'll show you how it works like in short like bone plate makes your lane if you're strong into champions like aurelia because she's like auto base the only way for her to like proc it is by uh it's by autoing you how should i hmm. uh we have no q here there we go i actually want to take a push on her we gotta sidestep her, uh, her stun. Ooh, nice try. Well, she's dead. I outplayed her so hard there. She had no chance. You know how I won this? It was because of my, uh, my pot that I used early. And I actually shielded her W. And then I walked backwards so that she couldn't fit in like another auto. And that's why I've actually won like so hard. Serve the greater good. Uh, we're having some trouble here. Rengar is not topside. Mm, we can't really push this. It's mainly because we uh, have no Joner here. I win. Oh! Her W hit in the end? So, if I didn't flash, I would have actually killed her. Like, I thought that she was going to press her W this way. I thought that she was going to press her W into the direction I was standing in. But I literally flash over here. She, she threw her W into this direction. And somehow her W has managed to hit me when I'm standing over here. It literally made no sense. Like the, the the lineup was so wrong. I actually want to see that back actually. Oh that mess that's gonna mess up my lane a lot, man. I'm not very happy with this. She's gonna come back with a Sheen, I think. We'll see. The uh, bone plate is definitely making things better. She can't really all in if I got bone plate. Uh, Rengar is playing the game mostly around bot lane. I'm not super happy with this. Mm, we got the wave stacking. Here we go. High chance Eve could be topside. Got an entire wave set up. Oh, she comes in now. Ah, oh, sucks, man. Sucks so much. Eve coming in on that right time. Like, I thought that Eve was around mid, but she was top lane. Rengar's coming top. What well, we're gonna lose on our plate now? Oh, uh, okay, sure. Rengar is gonna keep on cleaning up the wave. I think he's probably gonna be ganking bot lane like a lot. Probably. I'm assuming he Rengar's gonna be camping bot lane. Based on, uh, based on how Rengar is playing at the moment, I can 100% tell that he will never come top side. Because he's automatically by default like pathing towards spot with the uh, with the camps that he has. Hey, Flexi, coming in with another gift. You've already gift ten, man. Now you're gifting one again. Thank you, Flexi. Hmm. We can probably get a kill on Aurelia. 
Could we do it properly? Oh, we didn't expect it. Okay, we can uh, we can get a kill on this guy. Oh. Yep, and that's where he goes. He tried going for the outplay, but it didn't work for him. Now we get some plates. Eve is currently in bot lane, so don't have to worry about her. We'll keep this the way it is. Now we go back again. So this time we're gonna go for Fage. Uh, we could go for like an early Lucidity Boots. That will uh, definitely help. Take this one too. This is for the early power spike. Quick questions. Why Shield Bash over Transcendence and Gathering Storm? Well, um, in this matchup, uh, taking Shield Bash and Bone Plate, um, it gives you the push. Because Aurelia can't really all in you when you have Bone Plate up. Okay, let's slow push this one. She's level 7. Level 7 too. She's probably seeing inside the bush. Oh, seems like she's in the jungle. We got her. This Eve is here too. Okay, nice. Awesome. Absolutely awesome. Let's push right now. You see, like, despite uh, despite having a pretty terrible start, we are getting back right now. It's all looking good. Now we just have to push it. Got to get, like, at least one more plate. Yep. Now we go back. So you can kind of tell like when you play, uh, oh, whoa, she's already back? Wait, she's back already? My spirit is not lost. No, that's bad for me. That's so bad for me. She will clear this out instantly. Uh, I have to go back. She is so fast. Actually. So I, I guess, yeah, we killed her first before anyone else. That's why. Yep, she gets a plate. We're gonna to try to kill her right now. My hands are stained. Let's see. Let's slow push the wave. Can we go for the CS? She has Iron Spike. So she's going for the Gorge and can build. We got the bone plate down. And just keep still pushing it. For those who were lost. That's gonna push in. We'll see if it can go to mid. Maybe we can get some catches in mid lane and make a difference. Hmm. This guy doesn't all in. I got him. Ignatz is going to kill him. Ooh, this guy also flashes. So, yeah, we got the Kiana, that's all.
Yeah, she's going to get another plague now. I'm not I'm not very happy with this. I went to row mid lane to try and kill Kiana, but this Aurelia is like constantly pushing and she's getting the plates. That's the worst part. Um the fight took a little bit too long. She would try it all in. Yeah, she's testing it. Of the past. Hmm. I'm gonna respect her here. She is looking for the all in. She knows that my ultimate is down. So obviously I'm not gonna fight her right now. I'll take this stuff. Actually, I'll sell the... I'm going to sell the ward out so I can get the raw damage. Ooh, Fluxy coming in with four gifts more, man. That's absolutely amazing. <laughs> Thank you so much, Fluxy, for everything you've done. Wow. So many gifts. I'm going to get ganked. There's a uh, there's an Eve right here. I'm about to get one Fitude. I don't like the position I'm in here. I'm being forced to go into with 2v2 now. She's all the way there? Okay. I got you. Oh, she ends up getting me anyway. Oh, she's like... That was like one auto away from getting her. Like, my combos were completely on the wrong moment. I was so impressed that Eve was behind me. I had to use my 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 uh, my WE to run away from her. But when this guy all lent him, I had no chance to turn anymore. Because I, no, I had no stun. I had nothing. I had no E. I had nothing to, like, all in. So all I had to, all I could do was just walk around and and hope I get the the, the right moment, you know. Oh, uh, she has a Gorchenko now, and she has Steel Caps. If I actually killed Eve, I would have had so much gold right now. How should I proceed? The plates make the difference. Nice try. Nice try. My thing is like stacked up. I got gotcha. you. I love it so much when our Rayleigh play is trying to run. <laughs> yep, I got you too. Let's push this out. We're getting hard camp like crazy, man. The camp is insane in this game. Well, me. I mean, we're get, we're getting we're not getting like perma camps, but we are getting camped to the point where um, it's kind of messing up our lane. But thankfully, we have my teammates as well. We could try to stop him. You're dead. Or maybe not. He gave him the reset. Oh, he's flashing too. <laughs> Man, that's, this Kiana used to jump and then he used Prowler's Claw to chase me down. Mm, let's go for... Personally, I'm thinking about going for a Ghost Blade. 
But it's not very efficient against Aurelia too much. So I think I'm probably going to go for Death Sense anyway. Ooh, we could have had him. Let's go for a War 2. I think I'm going to run bot lane now. Probably. They're going to group around, uh, around this one. Hmm. Wait, wait a second. Uh, can you ask, why would you prefer giving subs over donating? Uh, I mean... I don't really have a preference. Not really that much. Although I... To tell you the truth... If you donate to a streamer, it gives you it gives the streamer the full amounts. If you actually send a gift or a sub to the streamer, the streamer only gets 50%. That's the only difference between uh, donating and sending in subs or gifting subs. It's what most people don't know. But uh, I have no preference, man. If you the, the way how you want to support is up to you. Got him. He's here. Nice. So my team can go for Baron right now. I mean for the Nasher. I mean for Hero, I mean. I wanna take this game. It's not there. Take down this camp. So, our goal is quite simple. All we want to do is just focus on pushing our lead by taking the camps we can find. Let's go for... I'm personally thinking about going for a Black Leaper now. I think we need this. Or Guardian Sanchez will also do fine. I'll go for this one. Hey, Nykobot coming with a donation of three. <laughs> Thank you, Nykobot. Gotcha. Oh, clean. Awesome. Hey, thank you, Nikobot, once again. Thank you for the three. We got a tower. I think I'll just let the wave drag it in. Oh, we are having trouble. Eve is right behind us. Oh, she's here. She won't be able to catch. We're getting close. All we need is like 50 gold more. So I suppose we can stay for this one. That was a random one. Ah, uh, it's my ignite. At least we uh we got the red buff, but we got the XP from the red buff.
I think if Rengar focused Eve, I would have been fine. I would have been just alive now. But he went for the Kiana kill. Makes sense. Otherwise, she would be able to run. But at the same time, I could have been alive if, if he went for Eve, I guess. Eve is strong. It's because she has the she has the stacks. She has like 10 stacks in Dark Shield right now. I mean, this, this game is 100% in our favor. You know, the only issue is is uh, is Eve this game. She is no problem. I have my flash coming like 20. We'll make a huge play soon. I'm thinking about going bot lane, actually. Trying to catch Lucian. Hmm. Okay. Wait, really? <laughs> uh, we're having some trouble here. That's an Eve around. Oh wow. That Vayne is doing so much damage, man. Deleting Aurelia before she could even jump. Oh, we stole it. Okay, we'll get this one. What is this thing? Oh wait, never mind. I was like wondering for a second, but it was the thing. Now we go back again, uh, this time. Oh, I guess Eve is probably here. Ah, she's not here. She's currently in the wolves. Hmm, let's go for... Hmm, I actually want to buy stopwatch, but uh, I'm not going to do it. Because I don't want to sell my Doran's Blade for it. How can you watch this match from the beginning, or are you going to upload this later? Yes, this game is going on YouTube. Yeah, don't worry. You'll be able to rewatch it. We can, uh, we can kill this Kiana here. Wait, this illusion is dead. He can't run. He can't kill him. Oh, I have my Gore Shrinker up. All he had to do was shield me. Oh, uh, wow. Yeah, yeah, literally all that Rakan had to do was, like, believe in me and just shield me already. He should have done that. Just jump on me. Like, I had Gore Shrinker up, you know? I sidestepped almost everything. I sidestepped, um... I sidestepped Kiana. I almost sidestepped Aurelia, too. And Rakan should have just came in. He, of course he didn't know. He was not going to know I was going to jump in, you know? Makes sense. But sad to see. But yeah, this game is uh, looking pretty good. I'm actually huge. I have my Guardian's Angel like 22. How should I proceed? Wait, I'll just wait just a tiny second for this. Okay, we got it. Now let's this time. I've got my flash coming in 60. So we'll see if we can make a good play now. Okay. Level 
not bad. Like, we can start something with this. It's only Kiana. I got her. Yep. You see? You just gotta chase for a bit. And you will get her eventually. Kiana can't run fast. You know, all she can do is CC you, and that's it. So, you can just chase that down with your dashes. Hey, that's a blue buff. Yeah, we're taking over this game. We are too massive for the enemy team to do any, just anything at all. Oh. Hmm, yeah, he's gonna, he's not gonna try. I got my team coming over. I wasn't really planning to use my flash or getting my Guardian's Angel off. That was not originally the plan. But uh it's okay. I love how Eve is like constantly jumping into me, but doesn't realize I can just trust my stun. No one ever expects the the Riffin to jump like that. Yep, now we get tower. Yep. And that's it. Either way, guys, this is Riven Top Lane against Aurelia while being camped. Thank you for watching today's YouTube video. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.